Okay, since this is a dev out and has existed for I think over two years now and hasn't really been redone and has developed over time, things are a little different than they are now. But essentially, um, out of my control box, I have some Ethernet cables for uh, the various things that I use. We'll go into a big bunched up cable, a uh, bit of a cable salad. But the point is, they go all together, then they go underneath here and across. I'll show you that. So they come in basically underneath there and then they're all joined in here. I have a USB hub mounted under here so I only have one connection to my computer which controls camera, um, what else, guide cam, regular cam, I don't know what the others are for, I forget. Anyway, um, then all the cables here are basically zip tied together and form a loop here so that when the I'll turn it off, when the uh, wheel rotates, it pulls. Not too bad, and when it goes the other way, it, you know, it forms a loop. So also not too bad. Um, then all these cables here. So we have two dew heaters, uh, two camera cables, and one power cable for the cooling of the of the uh, camera. And they all are zipped here to the pole this lift pull here zip tied and then come up uh, to the deck wheel they stay clear the ones that go onto the camera make this nice loop so that when this goes up it can go all the way over without snagging anywhere so that's really important that cables don't snag but you can see they're all either uh, zip tied or cloth tied so then and then of the other ones that come like the one that comes to the stepper goes just through here and attaches here. There's some more that go through the deck wheel here for the focuser motor, which is on the other side for me. But the important thing is all wires should be attached to something um, and they should not uh, leave the ring anywhere else except at the back here where the point of rotation is so that they don't snag and you know stop your out from turning that's really important